Hey, this is Chase Healy from American Solera, and this is What the Ales, Beer of the Week, Banana Coconut Blessings. Uh, and let me tell you something. We have blessed the city of Tulsa with this one. Uh, we're, you know, we're very famous and very well known for our IPAs, and uh, for this one, we went ahead and used a combination of, if you could guess, banana, coconut, vanilla, milk sugar, Sabro hops, Citra hops. It is the full Tropicana experience. You know when you were a kid and your parents would sometimes buy the Tropicana juice that was like the banana, orange, pineapple? Uh, well, think about that, but in a beer, and that's what you have. It is fantastic. So juicy, so tropical, and uh, so part of our seven years of uh, being a brewery. Uh, part of our seven year anniversary was that we've gone bananas. And uh, so we made several different beers that include bananas, and uh, this is one of them. Uh, being more of a milkshake style IPA, it's sweet, it's fruity, it's juicy. Uh, it's a lot of things all wrapped in, up into one, but, but I think Matt and the guys back in the, in the brewery have done a fantastic job with this one. So please come try it, come pick up a four pack. I think you're gonna love it. So along with Banana Coconut Blessing, uh, we did a Old Friends seven year edition. Uh, the Friends series that we do is on some of our farmhouse beers. And uh, so this will be one of our farmhouse beers that we aged in one of our oak fooders, the big oak tanks you see when you come in the building uh, for about a year. And then after that, we aged it in Chardonnay barrels for another eight months. So it's got just some really great Chardonnay character, funkiness from uh, all the wild yeast that's in it and uh, just a hint of tartness. I'd say this one is perfectly balanced and uh, just really complex and, and delicious. So the stout, uh, you know, the bottles are going quick on the stout, but we should have it uh, on draft for a little bit as well. But that's some of our barrel-aged imperial stout. I think this was 20 months in Buffalo Trace barrels. Uh, and then we aged it on wild Thai banana, cinnamon, uh, marshmallow, and vanilla uh, for like a creme brulee kind of banana type experience, so it's big, thick, luscious, delicious, you know how we do them here. Uh, but all of it's a big seven year celebration, so uh, you know we're so honored to call Tulsa home and uh, hope you guys just enjoy all the things we're doing here seven years down the road. First year American Solera opens 2016 424 day. That's the day that allowed breweries to sell beer directly to the public and that's when we decided to open, that's a huge part of the business we do is we want people to come to our brewery, be in our environment, experience American Solera. Uh, so that was the vision from day one. It took really moving here uh, you know, to the brewery district to I think fully realize that. But I can remember first year anniversary, we canned a very dark colored Terpy Citra in a really funky can. And uh, it was really the start year one when we kind of jumped into the IPA stuff and uh, you know haven't looked back for sure and obviously we do a little of everything but from being out west for year one to here in town for year seven it's a uh, it's been a fun fun ride for sure so this has been what the ales beer of the week banana coconut blessings cheers guys nice job Matt nice job